Happy New Year everybody and I'm Darren from Kingfish Computers. Okay, it is Wednesday the 4th of January 2017 and I hope you all had a very happy Christmas and a sublime New Year. Okay, um, I'm actually not open this week as it's the transition between everybody going back. Although I decided to come to Kingfisher to get a lot of little niggly jobs done. Okay, um, got a job in this morning, decided to make a video on it. Um, a customer comes in, um, has an audio company, he's having issues with streaming sites like Netflix, YouTube, etc. Obviously I had a quick look and found it was obviously covered in browser hijackers which were causing the issues. Okay, so I'll quickly show a little demonstration on a simple way how to resolve these issues. Okay, so this is the guy's laptop, so let's have a quick look. Excuse the shaking, it's the uh, Christmas drink coming out of me. So, straight into Google, nice little tool, ADW cleaner. First link, tools lib, get onto here. ADW as in, spell that way, Alpha, Delta, Whiskey, Cleaner, Charlie, Lima, Echo, oh God, I can't remember what A, Alpha, November, Echo, Romeo. Okay, so we're on the website, nice little secure website, use it all the time, click download now, and that will download a copy, obviously I'm using Google Chrome to download this, and there is the Etsy downloading. So, give it a second. And it's down. So, all we do, click on it, open it up. Obviously, UAC control, it's just asking for authentication if we want to open it. So, we will open it and run it. And. Doesn't seem. Right. So, he is, obviously, Malwarebytes has just acquired ADW Cleaner. All I generally do is make sure all your browsers are closed. We're going to options. Um, obviously, I pre ticked these earlier. Um, delete, obviously, image file execution option keys, tracing keys, prefetch files, then the reset. Um, take proxy, WinSoft, TCPIP settings, which are basically network settings. The firewall reset, uh, IPsec, uh, BitsQ, Internet Explorer policies. Um, Chrome policies, Chrome preferences, and host files. Um, so from that, all we do then is click scan. So obviously that will take a few seconds to scan. It's found obviously no files at the moment. Let's have a look at this. And what I'll do, I'll resume the video once oh, yeah. the scan's finished. Okay, peeps, the customers. Malwarebytes ADW Cleaner has finished scanning. So, let's see what's found. A couple of services. Um, folders. Whoa. All in. Update for Phil's computer. Babylon Toolbar, iMesh Toolbar. Stores, I bet you there's weather. Tarman, Babylon. I mess, she must have liked downloading. Driver update, there's a beauty one. Let's have a look at files. Bubble dock. Wind app, obviously. Uh, and a lot of registry files. There's actually, we've only found 123 threats, which isn't really that bad. I have actually seen it in the tens of thousands. So, all we do following this is click clean. Obviously, it's going to shut the programs down and restart the computer. So, let's give this a go. Just waiting for action. Deleting folders. Obviously, through here. It usually doesn't take that long. I have had it where it froze. And uh, it took forever. But, we will get there. So, all it's going to do now, it'll delete, obviously, all the service files, the folders the actual files and the registry values that have caused the issues. Um, again, I don't really, all it's basically going, going to do now is remove these files, then it should restart. 
um, with our issue resolved. So that is using Malwarebytes ADW Cleaner to fix hijackers, malware errors, um, spyware errors, obviously within browsers, thus possibly causing issues with surfing the internet, changing defaults, um, search engines, buffering, etc. Um, and basically, thank you very much. And I'm Darren from Kingfisher Computers. I hope you have a very good day and thank you for watching.